Hey, welcome to another Shoot Film episode. Before starting, I want to give you a little bit of, of, of a hint of what's going on and what you're about to see. So a few months ago, before traveling to Japan actually, I wrote to this guy who has an eBay store and his eBay store is Northern Film and he sells films, like re-spooled film uh, into film cartridges of 35mm and uh, I saw this particular film is the one that I saw, which is a 0.8 ISO film and I thought it was really interesting. It's a black and white slide film um, and I thought it was really cool because it has no sprocket holes and whatnot and I really wanted to give it a try and I will, but not on this video. So I wrote this guy and said, hey man, I, I would like to buy and purchase this you know, film from you and if you have any other films that you might want to uh, send me so I can try them out too on my channel, just feel free to do so. And he sent me a bunch of film, like a stack of, I don't know, like 20 films or something. Um, and I promised him that I would do a video about one of those films and that's what I'm doing. Uh, this is not sponsored or anything, it's just the guy was super friendly to me and he gave me this bunch of films to try and I really want to give them a try. So this time I will try the Fuji Reala 500D film. Um, and it's it's a, it's a movie film, so you have to use it and then remove the ramjet and whatnot. So it's basically the same as the Vision 3 500T or 200T or whatever, but it's a 500D. It's a Fuji Reala 500D if you want to give it a try. Uh, the link is in the description if you want to visit uh, the store, Northern Film Store. It's in the UK. Um, just go there, check it out and yeah that's all. Now regarding the content of the video this was shot in Santiago uh, about a month and a half ago and I was there visiting and touring with my band and whatnot and I had my expert with me and I had this Fuji Reala 500D film and I asked my friend Fernando if he could shoot me while taking some pictures. He always shoots dancers and ballerina dancers and you know classical dancers uh, in studio situations and I asked him hey what if I if, if you can get one of those dancers that you always take pictures of and we go outside and take pictures on the street so I can combine it with something that I'm more familiar with because I'm not going to take pictures on studio of dancers. And he was like, oh yeah, that sounds pretty good. Okay, I can arrange that. So what you're about to see is exactly that, is me trying to take pictures with the X-Pen uh, with some dancers uh, in the streets and trying to combine those two worlds. I hope you enjoy this episode and yeah. Tres, dos, uno. Boom. Hello guys, we are in the center of Santiago City and I am with my friend Fernando behind the camera and today, hold on, I will be shooting with my trusty old expan uh, and I'll be shooting this film, it's actually some Fuji Reala, it's a ISO 500D which means it's for daylight and I will be shooting this combo and yeah, we'll be shooting some dancing scenes and I don't know, let's just have fun.
Cuando quiera. description so you can check her Instagram and follow her and yeah follow the all around awesomeness and that's it I hope you enjoyed it and I will see you next time and that's it, I hope you enjoyed the episode, I hope you had fun with it, I had a lot of fun shooting these pictures, uh, I think it's, a, it's an interesting thing to get out of your comfort zone and try new stuff, I have never shot dancers uh, before and of course I've never done dancers on the street so this was my first time and I had a really good time so thanks a lot Fernando for allowing me to do this and to Connie for being there and let me take her pictures and have fun on the streets so that was great I hope I can do that again like now it's winter and it's so cold outside and I don't want to go out and take street photography pictures it's it's not really a fun environment to do so right now so um, I hope I can do more of this stuff. And before leaving, I want to give a big shout to my patrons because as always, they help me a lot and they support the channel and they allow me to buy cameras and then give them away. So if you're interested in joining the Patreon raffle in which I buy a camera, a film camera, I try it on the channel and then I give them to one of my patrons, uh, just join the fun and, <laughs> and follow the link in the description. Or I guess I'll leave a link right here in, if you want to see it. I don't know, I'll, Eduardo who, will edit this future Eduardo will take care of this so yeah that's that's all I have to say thanks a lot for sticking by and I will see you next week until then keep shooting guys